Okay, let's start. So, ang pag-invest sa stock market ay isang passive income. So, kapag ka bumili ka ng stock, ibig sabihin, bumili ka ng shares or ownership ng company. So, once you buy or invest a stock, you now become a part owner or a shareholder. And as a shareholder, you can now participate dun sa company's growth and success. Siyempre. So, paano nga ba kumita sa stock market? In the simplest explanation, bibili ka ng stock na mura and ipabenta mo ng mahal. Ayos ba? Ang daling sabihin, ang hirap gawin. So, bigyan ka ng example. So, for example, bumili ka ng Jollibee Food Corporation na stock. Kapag ka bumili ka ng Jollibee, JFC yung stock code. Ibig sabihin, kasaba ka na ng Jollibee sa paglago ng kumpanya. So, for example, bumili ka ng shares ng Jollibee worth 100 pesos. And after one month, yung price ng stock naging 150 pesos. Ibig sabihin, kumita ka na ng 50 pesos. There are two ways to earn in the stock market. One is capital gains and then two are dividends. So, pag-usapan muna natin kung ano yung capital gains. So, bigyan natin kita ng example yung URC. So, anong klaseng company ba tong URC? Can you comment down below kung alam mo kung ano mga products nila? URC is a food and beverage company. So, meron sila. Kiatos, Nova, Cream O, Magic Flakes, Max, yung Candy, Cloud9, Great Day, C2, Nissin. Let me show you. So, let me show you how URC has gained in past years. So, here's URC. 2009 to... 2015, yung gagamitin nating example. So, that's a total of 6 years. So, from a stock price of somewhere around... So, from the price of 2009, for example, bumili ka ng 20 pesos, somewhere around 2015, you would have earned as much as 19,000%. Diba? So, in, in 6 years, yung 20 pesos naging somewhere around 200, 200 pesos or kahit sige dito na, somewhere around 200 pesos. Ito yung stock price. Okay. So, that's one way of earning. So, let's put it in a context na kunyari bumili ka talaga ng URC. So, Yan. So, for example, bumili ka ng 5,000 shares of URC for 20 pesos. So, meron kang capital na 100,000 pesos. And then, binenta mo siya when it hit 200 pesos here, you would have had 1 million pesos after 6 years. So, that's one way of earning in the stock market. Malina? Dividends naman are companies reward to its investors through cash dividends or issuing stocks dividends. So, yung cash dividends, ibig sabihin, ibabalik nila yung portion of the, the pera sa'yo and then stock dividends, ibabalikan niya ng number of stock shares. So, dividends are divided accordingly to the shares of all stockholders. So, ibig sabihin, mas marami yung shares mo, mas malaki yung makukuha mong dividends. Siyempre, yung frequency din niya is iba-iba. May dividends na, may companies na nagbibigay ng dividends ng quarterly, ng semi-annually, may annual. Yung schedule non, you can see that on your online trading account kapag ka meron ka na. So, pakita ko sa'yo yung example. So, ito ang isang example ng maliit na kita sa dividends na Okay, so here's an example of a cash dividend. So, the stock code is AP. This is Aboitis Power. So, the company is giving away a cash dividend for 1 peso and 47 cents per share. So, the total number of shares for this example, so ito, ang total number of shares is 400. So, medyo maliit lang. Um, so, meron pa rin siyang tax, syempre rin nawawala yung tax. So, the, the gross amount, so, 1.47 times 400 is 588, less withholding tax. So, this is now your total dividend for for that payout period. So, hindi lahat ng company nagbibigay ng dividends. Depende kasi yun kung um, nakaschedule yun sa kanila 
um, or kung hindi sila mag expand they give out dividends. So, this is one way of earning in the stock market. So, yung ibig ko sabihin kanina na the dividends are divided according to the number of shares, ibig sabihin itong 400, mas malaki to, syempre, mas magiging mas malaki yung net amount. Okay yun lang. So, I hope you learned in this video kung paano kumita sa stock market. Kung wala ka pang alam kung paano mag-invest, mahalaga na mag-aral, magbasa, at magtanong. So, iwasan natin yung mindset na instant yaman, yung power, yung guaranteed return of income or investment. The Bible says in Proverbs 13 verse 11 that wealth from get-rich-quick schemes quickly disappears but wealth from hard work grows over time. I hope this video helps you make money, make time, and make your future today through stock investing. God bless and see you on the next video.